Hi, I'm Larry Thorpe. I work at the Center for American Progress. I had the privilege of working with Mike for quite a lot in the last couple of years. I also live in Virginia, and I live in a place called Watergate and Landville. If you're familiar with Virginia, we must have like 2,000 people there. Most of them are focused on the governor's race, but I have been talking about the lieutenant governor. They'll say, oh, yeah, it's not that everybody's, you know, Moran or Gallup or whatever they want to And I tell people I'm the last living Eisenhower Republican. And I work for Ronald Reagan, but of course the Republican Party has just gone off the deep end, you know, in terms of things that they've done. I also had the privilege of uh, working for three years with a fellow by the name of Webb, who's now a senator from uh, Virginia. And, and, and Mike reminds me of Jim, not the temperament, but in terms of his grasp of the issues, uh, in terms of, you know, working with us, he did a great job on Homeland Security, which again is a big issue for anybody who's involved in state politics. And then he wrote this wonderful thing about demagoguery in politics, and again, which shows you, you know, where we've come. I mean, you know, we've just gotten to the point where we don't really sit down and debate these issues and bring, uh, you know, meaningful analysis uh, uh, to it. Uh, back in uh, early 2007, Tony Lane called me and asked me if I would work in the Obama campaign. And one of the things that I impressed me about then Senator and now President Obama was that he was balanced, he was thoughtful. Uh, it was uh, basically try to do the right thing. And I think Mike has a lot of those uh, characteristics. So I'm really pleased to be here and say that I think he'll, he'll do a great job. And I think this is just going to be the beginning for Mike. I think uh, the world here five or ten years from now will be governor or senator and be moving in that direction. But I think the state will be lucky, and as a resident of Virginia, I feel very good about it. And in fact, I can never remember anybody who's ever run for lieutenant governor before. I just never paid any attention to, <laughs> to it. But uh, now that Mike is, I think, we'll be in, uh, we'll be in, we'll be in good shape. So, Mike, thanks for having me. And, uh,